Billy, you so crazy. Yo, what's cracking? What's bracking? It's your boy, Billy, you so crazy. And we back, and we back, and we back, and we back with another one. Look, man, y'all read the title. Y'all already know what this is, all right? If you've been watching my Mass Singer series, man, you know that I've been consistently on top of every single episode, on top of every single unmasking. And for some reason, this, this whole, this, 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 you know what's going on out here in these streets. It's messing with everything. So I guess there was the, the last episode 12, they did some singing spectacular stuff. Didn't want to watch that. No point in that. You know, they didn't even upload it on you on uh, Hulu. Waste of time, right? Because there was no one that got unmasked at the end of it. Then we jump to episode 13. I find out that there's a two part and they're doing this live from Zoom, you know, like the little conference joints. And then I find out that the banana went home. Luckily, I stopped it before I seen who it was. I'm telling, I'm pissed right now because I'm like, when the, what episode is this? Because episode 12, it was a singing spectacular. Then y'all start off episode 13 and it's a two part. And then y'all say the banana went home. When did the banana go home? So I don't know what episode it is because it's not uploaded on Hulu. I couldn't find it. And then when I go on YouTube, I see episode 12, but they talking about it's a singer spectacular and nobody's going home at that at the end of the episode. So I'm like, what the? So this whole thing is just jacked up. So luckily I typed on YouTube <laughs> all of the bananas performances and the, the, the unveiling. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to chop up all of the clips that I had of the bananas performances and all that stuff. And then I'm just going to get, I'm going to skip to the end of this video and shout out to randomized content. Y'all be sure to go subscribe to him. He done, he done, he done bailed me out a couple times, a couple times. All right. Bailed me out a couple times. So we're going to get to, we are going to get to his final performance that I didn't get to see. And then we're going to see the unveiling. All right. But you guys are going to see all of the clips put together. If you guys want to see the full episode review before all of this craziness happened, head over to patreon.com slash Billy. You so crazy. You can watch those episodes for $2. All right. And my apologies to the crazy pack members that, you know, wanted to see the full episode review, but these last two episodes, they just completely just, I don't know. I don't know. Y'all I'm frustrated. I am frustrated, but we just going to push through. All right, still blessed. I'm good. All right, enough of the complaint, enough of the rant. The video starts now. I don't know. My guesses for Group B has been terrible, y'all. My apologies. I am, I'm stuck with this group. Group A, I knew all of them. Group B is just like. It is the banana. And the mouse, like I've heard her voice, but I can't think who I think it is though. Like I can't think of the name for some reason. I don't know why. So we're gonna find out who went home. He got a lot of energy. There's a lot of tall people, man. Let us unpeel the appealing mystery of the banana. Let us unpeel the appealing. Cowboy hat. Cowboy. For the stage. Oh, I can't believe I overdid it last night. You'd think this was my first rodeo. Rodeo. Maybe it's from the south. I'm the banana because I'm tough on the outside, but a total smoothie on the inside, and a hoot to have at parties. Oh no! Am I right, oh ladies? no! There are a lot of he's, hangover references. He's trying to be young. How big a drip stag got it? Blue collar, blue collar he said, God, I can't wait what is that? to peel back my layers and show I can use my voice in any environment. I just want to see you smile. None of those clues help me out. I don't know. Group B is just, they're stunning me. I don't know. Whoa. Hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute.
This is probably the most entertaining. He had a lot of stuff going on. They actually have bananas. Let's talk performance for a second. King. This is what the show is all about. Having yes. energy, just having yes. fun on stage. You remind me of the White Tiger. Very goofy, charismatic. No, let's not talk about the White Tiger. Because he, has he the needs to get off the show. of a young Robin Thicke. That's what I believe. <laughs> all right, so did you always want to be the banana? <laughs> Technically, no. <laughs> what? That My was the only kid, costume? I'm getting ready to work out. She hands me a banana, and it's a sign. So here I am, the banana. And I'm peeling it. I'm peeling the music. I'm peeling it, too. There's a little bit of a country. It's not yeah. a lot of draw, though. It's yeah. a little bit. Yeah, I can't wait to hear some of yeah. your guesses. There's Jenny, a lot of country in there. Any clues? Well, you know, I saw the uh, blue collar, and that uh, rang a bell with the blue collar comedy tour. Yes, yes. Um, then I also saw the, country, the hat, the cowboy hat. Mm -hmm. And there's a comedian on that tour. He also wears a cowboy hat. Yeah. Bill Engvall. Yeah, yeah. You think it's That's young? You think right. it's Bill? You think it's, it's Bill that tall? I was picking up on the Hangover references. Good movie. Yes. Like, great movie. Great movie, Ken. Like, I'm a fan. I love Yeah, y'all go scream Hangover so <laughs> Ken can get that check. You feels me. I'm thinking Ed Helms. Oh, Ed Helms? Actually, that's actually a really good, good Ed. That's Ed a fair guess. Georgia. Oh yeah, that's a really good guess. But then what that's really a fair stood guess. out to me were two things. There's the it was a blowfish. Yeah. yeah. Ah. And then he did say I'm a hoot at parties, so I'm gonna put hoot and blowfish. Hootie and a blowfish. Oh. Hey. I'm gonna go Darius Rucker. Darius Rucker. But Darius, Darius would have sang that. Voice Darius would have sang that. Was he was doing Elvis. So if you're mimicking a well-known voice, you're not really using your own sound yet. So I think there's a lot more he, to come. Darius, to the is he that tall? To know his sound. Yeah. And Darius, yeah. he ain't really built yeah. that slim, is he? I don't think that's Darius. I don't think the that's Darius. But I'm ready. Who's going home? Who did y'all vote off? It better not be the mouse. Who do you think it is? Gabriel Iglesias has came a long way. Super successful. What else is there to know about this side splitting talent? Let's watch together. Who is that? These clues never help me out, though. You guys always pick up on it. Cathartic becoming the banana would be, so making it to the Group B championships is sounding more and more appealing. Hmm. I don't want to slip up. So when my team slip called up. me in for a meeting about my image, I was like, get her done. I walk in, and these guys are nervous. He does have like a country cowboy accent. Like cowboy hat last week. It might be. Spit it out. You don't got to hold my hand. Finally, they say, look, we have some concerns about your shelf life, so we think you could use a rebrand. You're worthy of your own bowl, like acai. A star in your own show on cable, like that orange. Or star in your own show, Sons so maybe he hasn't starred in the show yet. I've heard enough. I may be high in carbs, I may have a few bruises, but I'm still here after all these years. So tonight, I'm embracing my flaws. Rocking out as my authentic self. Group mm. B championships, here I can. I don't know. These clues never help me out. You guys are always able to pick up on stuff. I'm but just be lost in the sauce. Yeah. They get starchy when they're ripening up. Needless to say, I won't be good at riddles. Hey. Is he gonna start singing or what? And if you tell my heart, my achy breaking heart, not go up and do this man. That you can tell the world, you never was my girl. And you can burn my clothes up when I'm gone. And you can tell my lips, Look at you better to dance, girl. Tips, they won't be reaching out for you no more. And you can tell your friends just what a fool I've been. And every night I'm being on this song and don't tell my heart my achy breaky heart every night I'm gonna bring it raise your hands so don't tell your heart my achy breaky heart I just don't think he'd understand and if you tell my heart I definitely feel like I've heard this voice but maybe only once or twice I'm not confident in the banana real raspy voice though just don't think you understand And if you tell my heart 
Hey. Hey. Y'all, yeah. tell me. Tell me y'all seen the girl behind Nick going ham. Tell me y'all seen her. I love the audience's reactions. They're always, oh, you better step on them. You better step on them. Hey, hey. You better step on them. You better step on them. That was a good performance. That was. This is the craziest show I've ever been on. Yeah. Where, when did he get the hat? Did I miss that? You, you must, you Has he had that on the whole time? Performance. Uh, I tell you what, man, I had me a good old time up here. <laughs> wow, that's pretty good. This is what the show is all about. This is about connecting with the audience and having fun. We're all having fun if the performer is having fun. Yes. Like, I have fun just watching. Me. I have fun just watching. This season, we asked our class of 2020 what was their favorite subject in school. Maybe that can give us some clues about your identity. What was the banana's favorite subject? Why would that give me a well, clue? Well, for me, no doubt was art. It has gotten me through some of the toughest times of my life, and I've had quite a few. And uh, um, tonight, even though I forgot half the lyrics, I was having the time of my life, forgetting about the troubles, having a good time. Oh my gosh, I love banana. Panel, you guys picking up on any clues? You know, no. last week, I was thinking Jeff Foxworthy, but then in the clue package, I heard the person say, get her done, which makes me think <laughs> of another blue collar comedian, Larry the Cable Guy. And Ain't in Larry the clue bigger? package, he's looking for a <laughs> rebrand. So I'm on Larry the Cable Guy is a lot bigger guy. than that, right? No, but his I'm positive. because my arm, he is lean. There's yeah. No way that fox yeah, that's is Larry. that's what not Larry. On a keto diet, that I'm ain't Larry. Only bananas. No, they're high in carbs. We just found that out. <laughs> yeah, that ain't Larry, but, but I will it could agree be Bill. With you on this, Ken. I will jump on your comedian train. Last week I said Ed Helms um, because the clue package had a lot of references towards Hangover, and then this week there were Office vibes. Yeah. Right. Yes. So I'm still sticking with Ed Helms. All right, Gay, were you picking up on comedian vibes? He got the same uh, body type. In the, um, the clues package, I was picking up on a few things that kind of made me think originally Eric Estrada. Yeah. You know, like the, uh, the motorcycles, uh, uh, chips. chips. <laughs> he got straight um, into it. 213, which is uh, OG LA area code. Yep. Yeah. Then I'm it like, is. you know what? Nah, this, 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 this person sings for real. So I so one, three, three, one, personally oh. am going to choose Billy Bob Thornton because he's a, a great performer, singer. Billy Bob and, Thornton. Uh, he does ride motorcycles. They're the he's same height? Too, yeah, yeah. I don't know how tall Billy Bob Thornton is. Billy Bob Thornton, that's not bad. I think that's a solid guess. I'm still very perplexed yeah. by Ken's Ooh, Larry perplexed. the Cable Guy. Like, <laughs> there's just something about the voice. No, I didn't want you to start talking again. I just wanted to say Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, Thank he's you. definitely keeping us guessing. Y'all keep it going. For the banana. We love you, Nana. I love my Nana, too. Our panel was all over the produce <laughs> aisle with their guesses. What do you think? Yeah, we can, we can, I can guarantee Larry I can't ain't under there for sure. Nothing but the ultimate fun. I am feeling the music, I'm feeling the fans, and this is awesome. I go with Ed or, um, keep it locked. The battle to. But this banana needs a fan. Because needs. the unbelievable amount of sweating is happening under this mask. I'm planning to keep boiling under this peel all the way to the Super 9. The Super 9. Who is that? Welcome back to Who the Who is it singer. for real? Last week, Banana hammocked his way through Billy Ray Cyrus's achy breaky art. But who is this powerful plantain? Here are some new. Definitely a comedian for sure. Faux fan of family. Banana Faux Fana. I'm loving performing as a banana. But last week, I had a little setback. Even though I forgot half the lyrics, I was having the time of my life. <laughs> my memory's not what it used to be. Mine neither. I'm a real driven banana. Don't believe me? Ask these two lovely ladies. Oh, you got two? Would someone be surprised to find out about banana? Uh, he's such a great role model. So are these his kids? Kids in the witness protection program? <laughs> when we were younger, <laughs> Banana actually taught us how to drive by getting us go-karts. 
He decided to build a racetrack in our backyard. He dug up all the bushes himself. Anything to make us smile. Aww. How sweet is that? He's wow. been through a lot of heartburn in his life, but he's always been able to laugh through anything. A go-kart in he your backyard? And Dan was like, guess what? I'm going to be on the mass Singer. And I was like, no way. Now I get to see him in his banana costume, what we've always wanted to see him in. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta do it for the children, man. Anything for the children. Anything for the children. So, times in our lives, we all have pain. We all have sorrow. Go ahead now. But sorrow. If we are wise, then we all know there's always tomorrow. You can lean on me when you're not strong. I'll be your friend. I'll help you carry on. Could it be Bill? It could be Bill. It could be new. Hey, y'all better step on him though. Hold up. Hold up. Give me a Hold up. Hey. Oh. Hey. Take me to church now. Hallelujah. Hey. 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 That's what I'm saying. You better. LA backup dance is going hell. Hey! 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 You can call me Lord, you can lean. Hallelujah! Lord, Lord, you can lean. Yes. Lord, you can lean. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yes. Not the. Not the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He had the best performance tonight. He's had the best performance. I don't know. Was that Bill? Was that Bill? Ooh, 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 ooh. Hallelujah. Go ahead, Rob. Week, Banana, you have delivered, and that's what I love about definitely show. delivered you know, for sure. Types of singers, but your essence that comes out of you, Banana, you're able to get the audience on their feet every single week. Yes, and yes. you can sing. Fire. You did an amazing job. Come on, I'm having a snap. <laughs> hey, yes. high knees, high knees, high knees. Banana, in all seriousness, uh, tell us why you picked that song. Well, my father, who's like my best friend. And he recently passed away. Oh, no. And this man was a true hero. He loved music. Yeah, and this man. song was our jam. Our condolences for your loss. Yeah, in all seriousness, this is the best performance. You've I'm done telling so you. Far. I, so I think amazing. it's the best performance of the night for sure. I liked his a lot. But the frog really ain't performed yet. You're a great person. So I already know Bow Wow going to do something goofy. I already know Bow Wow will. Person. We have another clue for you guys. Another clue? Banana. Oh, the Who bracelet. Is your friendship bracelet for. My bracelet. Mm-hmm. It's for Jenny. Oh. Well, Jenny thing? kissed everybody. She already admitted it, so. Oh, it says '90s love. Oh, '90s love. There it is. I'm just gonna say we had a little chance to hang as friends. Oh, for sure, sure. Sound like a little more than hanging at this point. Uh, Especially with Jenny. We had a great time. Especially with Jenny. You're an awesome person. Um, I'm glad he said it with respect, though. Anything? It's a married um, woman. Today I was thinking, okay, more race car driver because Driven was one of the first clues on there. I had Dale Earnhardt Jr. Yep. But based off this clue, I mean, I am friends with Michael Andretti. Ah. That's great. Michael Back Andretti. We became friends at the Playboy Mansion. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, boy. Vroom, vroom. <laughs> I Shit did guess. not kiss him, everybody. <laughs> That's fine. That's a great guess. But I'm going to go a different route. This Sip my tea, sis. As a country singer, but they started hosting a variety series. Um, one of their albums was that called good. Wheelhouse. <laughs> right. So I'm going to go with Brad Paisley. Wow. That is a good guess. That ain't no Brad Paisley. But, you know, last week, That's not no Brad Paisley. He has the voice of Larry the Cable Guy. <laughs> he does. He don't he got does. the body, though. And look at the clues. It says heartburn. 
Larry, the cable guy, is a spokesman for Prilosec. I know. <laughs> oh, he is. My God. True. I know, because I'm a friggin' doctor, all right? <laughs> I'm going to tell you, that's not Larry, the cable guy. He is lean. I think he's yeah. on a keto diet. I think it's Larry, the keto guy. <laughs> there it is. Thank you, kid. Larry, the keto guy. Get it, kid. I'm not even going to get mad at him. It's funny. T-Pain, who is this banana, man? Man, uh, uh, Give me some logic, uh, T-Pain, please. Enough, has kids, um, would absolutely rent out a backhoe to dig out a track in their yard somewhere. Um, <laughs> this person was in Dukes of Hazards, a lot of driving in that. So I'm thinking Johnny Knoxville. How many times are we going to guess Johnny Knoxville <laughs> in Mass Singer history? We yeah. guessed Johnny Knoxville like a many, many times. But remember what happened with Sherry Shepard. We thought seven different people were yeah. Sherry Shepard. <laughs> yeah. And then when Sherry, was Shepherd Sherry Shepard was on the show, none of us guessed yeah. her. <laughs> yeah. And look, I'm thinking Johnny Knoxville, but I'm also more glad I get to see what the inside of a minion looks like, so I'm good. And thank you. <laughs> <laughs> the inside of a minion. <laughs> He just T Pain just be saying anything. I feel him though. That's me. That's that's me all the way. I feel it. I get it. All right, y'all. Next up is the frog. Yes, Who do you think it is? It's a it's a comedian for sure. It's definitely a comedian. He likes to tell jokes. I gave Jenny the friendship bracelet, which completely threw off her game. Is she biting her lip, girl? I'm feeling like kicking some potassium. Not some potassium. Jenny having some flashbacks of something. Introducing. All right, this is stuff I haven't seen. We both got knocked on our butts in a Super 9. White Tiger, Banana, and Rhino are in the bottom three. Every time this banana is up against the ropes, I bounce back. Ever since a massive injury I suffered, my memory has been the same. Massive That's injury. Why I write my lyrics on my hands. I'm a scrappy banana. In the past, I put a lot of pressure on myself to succeed, and that's when I flopped the hardest. With all the competition in the Super 9, I tried to do too much on stage. So tonight, I'm taking things nice and slow. I know Banana's a fighter, but heck, I'm a fighter too. And I've taken on much worse in my time. One thing is clear, though. There's only room on this stage for one of us. <laughs> Mama, take this badge from me. Oh, this shoes is dope. Use it anymore. Anymore. Oh, she is gorgeous. It's getting down to Dr. C. Feels like I'm knocking on heaven's door. I, I, I say. Brett Michaels? I don't even know if I know what Brett Michaels sounds like. I can't shoot them anymore. No. She feeling it. <laughs> she feeling it. Dark gray cloud, it's a coming down. I feel like I'm knocking on heaven's door. I, I, I say. Knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door. Everybody Down. raise your hands. Come on. Come on. Knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door. Woo! Woo! Bring it on! Bring it on! Smackdown. Got banana! House. Oh. Well put together, everybody knows this is how the story goes. You know she's got everything. Everything. He got the hip, okay. Hey. Ain't holding nothing back. Oh, she's a brick. Come on. Woo! How? Woo! 
Built like an Amazon. You better get up out of her face. You better get out the kitty face. All right, so since we already know that he goes home. Big so numbers. much fun! Woo! You Woo. had us all. Uh, thank you guys for everything. <laughs> Wait, hold on, man. Banana fans rule. Yeah, how in the <laughs> world did you have enough time to be here with us and you're rehearsing for your stadium solo tour? I gotta tell you, I would have done anything to get here. This is the most awesome show. Wow. I've never had such a great time. Oh, this is a party. Yeah. You all rock, and the banana fans out here yes. are awesome. I love it here. We are so, so blown away were each that he week was the you comedian. delivered. I just you. loved watching you. Absolutely. Thank you very and much. I'm just so grateful that you were part of the show, and thank, thank you for you. doing it. You were amazing. Thank you. Brett, did you choose to be a banana? I did. <laughs> How sick is that? What's what, But it fooled us. Nobody would think of a rock god to no. be yes. in a banana, yes. banana costume. Yes. You could go <laughs> Mrs. Sharon Osborne. Oh, no. No. She was. She convinced everybody up there. Except Ken. Honestly, I was convinced your cadence was just like Larry the Cable Guy. In the yeah, that was probably one of the worst guests ever. Yeah, that was <laughs> that's what I thought. You talk about how much fun you've had on this show yeah. and a, an amazing experience, but your kids love this show and you watch yeah. this with them. And that, is that one of the reasons why you did the show initially? One million percent. I love the show. The kids love the show. The family loves the show. And I want this to go on forever. Like, it's such an upbeat, positive party. The world it needs is. it right now. Oh, it is. Great. Yeah. Yeah. Until I couldn't figure out the episode. So great positive energy right now in this show not ripping people down not tearing them down not beating them up such an emotional performance so sincere great job i'm just gonna be honest with you it was something i wanted to do and this show was one of the best times of my life i loved every second of it I now absolutely know what it feels like to be a living, breathing Batman, right? It's <laughs> unbelievable when you're completely a living, breathing Batman. anonymous. And I'm walking by everybody that I know, people I've known forever, people working here, fans that are out there, the panel. It is a crazy feeling, but I, I love that it. it's part of the absolute magic of this great show. Satisfy me. The most craziest thing is putting on that head. It's surreal in there. Like, and a lot of times when I'm moving, it, it come down. I 1,000% say it's way, way more nerve-wracking for me. I've lived a whole career of absolute freestyle. I started in my soaking wet basement in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, jamming without the sump pump working. Half the, the stuff pump? I couldn't even see. What like, is I literally pump? couldn't see where I was going, and I was just winging it. The truth is, when you're a true freestyle performer, and you're out there giving everything you have. I, I promise you one thing, leave it all out there in the stage. I do it every single time. There's nothing I reserve. You know, you practice it, but then when you get out there, you just gotta let it fly and, and true, true. not overthink it and just really live in the moment. This is like the longest post interview right I've ever seen in my life. Stage and I have banana energy and I forget all the choreography. The choreographer just finally said, just stand somewhere over there. They gave up. They, I don't got the dance <laughs> moves, but I was trying to just bring the, the old <laughs> school gravelly, just stand like there. Sharon Osbourne said, I got gravelly pipes. And uh, so I was just bringing them out there and, and literally having fun. So don't tell your heart, my achy breaky heart, I just don't think he'd understand. The banana, first of all, a couple things. It, it's based on energy. I've been a lifelong diabetic, so five injections a day since I've been six years old. Um, and I just I, I never let adversity get me down. Oh Very true. And sometimes I just channel okay. that energy, that power Inspire helps me, me get past thinking about it too much. And I get out on that stage, and it is everything bad goes away, and it's just awesome up there. And I wish I could tell you I can control it sometimes, but I can't. I just get out there and have fun. If it's a fun song, if it's a ballad, and it's coming from your soul like that, let your soul shine. You can call on the brother when you need a hand. We all need somebody to lean on. Sometimes forget the vocals, or, or I'd rather forget the words after the 
crazy brain hemorrhage I had. So I, I write stuff down and just sparks it, but I'm having an amazing time. Even though I forgot half the lyrics, I was having the time of my life, forgetting about the troubles, having a good time. Oh my gosh, I love Banana! I laughed so hard, all the judges looking up there and, and knowing them and having partied with some of them before and had some good times. First with Blue Collar, I was trying to really throw them off. I come from a, uh, a small town outside Oh, see, they, they do be throwing people Butler. off with them And so pits. the Blue Collar, that's part of it. And then also I have a huge pet line I've done for years and years with PetSmart. Really? We always had some poisonous items in there. There was always something like the killer blowfish. I believe there was a snake, maybe a spider. And then for the tongue, we have Open Up and Say Ah, which had you know nothing but a good time, every rose, all these big hit songs. And as you go, I think they were starting to figure out my vocal, the, the sound and, and style on stage. Knock, knock, knock it all, heaven's tower. So every time they would say something that was my name, I'd be like, yeah, no. You know, it's this moment of, yeah, sure, no. That's not right, because I want to stay on. I'm competitive, but fun. I wanted to stay on the show. That boy kicked that stool. Go ahead. He kicked that stool. That's when he stopped playing with y'all. That's when he stopped playing with y'all. Heaven's door for the first verse there was no there was no sound in my headset in my in-ears so i was just winging it i'm like i'm playing it on the piano for real like i do at home and i'm like man i better i hope i'm even in the right song right now uh, and uh it happened on uh achy breaky heart with me too so i just learned stay cool stay calm and and just bring all that years of musical knowledge of being out on the road. I pick songs I wouldn't normally do, songs I love but I wouldn't normally sing, changed up my voice, uh, and then they're putting you through choreography and things that they want to do, and then there's things you want to do, and you just make that all work. I gotta tell you, I would have done anything to get here. This is the most awesome show. Wow. I've never had such a great time. Oh, this is a party. Yeah. You all rock, and the banana fans out here. Yeah. Oh, awesome, I love it. To all of the amazing fans on behalf of Poison, on behalf of my solo career, on behalf of the banana, I just want to say thank you to all three or four generations. Mm. I am telling you, this is nothing but gratitude for letting me live my dream out and have a show like this and have a ton of fun. This has been awesome. Uh, I'm sincerely going to miss you, banana. Banana Don't rock go down the history right here. I may steal banana. Banana's coming with me. That's, I mean, that's you. You are the banana. Yo, so shout out to uh, Randomized Content. Y'all be sure to go check out his channel, man. Once again, saved your boy. I appreciate you. All right, y'all, look. I still don't know. Maybe this was at the end of episode 12. I don't know. Like I said, when I was scrubbing through it, there was no there was no reveal. There was nothing. It was just like a sing-along. Maybe I just skipped over that part. I don't know. But either way, you know, this is on YouTube. It's chopped up. My bad to my crazy pack members. <laughs> I don't know what happened and nobody hit me. Y'all didn't tell me like, yo, Billy, you missed the episode or nothing. Like there was a reveal in this episode. So I guess, I guess it was just like a surprise. I don't know. I really don't know. I do not have the slightest clue, but if you know who it was the whole time, let me know in the comment section. If you did enjoy this video outside of my rant, you know what I'm saying? Give this video a thumbs up. I have a whole playlist of mass Singer videos. You guys can go back and watch from season one all the way up to season three. Full episode reviews over on my Patreon, patreon.com slash Billy, you so crazy two dollars if you want to you know except for the last two episodes i didn't do those but if you want to watch all the way up to episode 11 they're there you know what i'm saying but anyways it's your boy billy you so crazy and i see you on the next video man i'm out this thing